Over here, we have an example of the two modes. And on these two modes, uh, you see that they are different. This is for a samosa, and, and this is for a dumpling. And the modes come with uh, a built-in uh, conveyor belt system. So that way it makes the samosa um, or pastry, the dumpling, come out faster. So this is another one here. This is a, a, a large samosa that, um, mold. And with our machine, you get a uh, instructional manual. Okay, you get the instructions and details, uh, and any troubleshooting, that's also available. Over here, I'm gonna first start on the body. Here, I'm gonna open this up for you. This machine is built uh, all three, uh, 304 stain full stainless steel. It has four independent motors, which controls each part of making a samosa. Okay, so you have uh, the mold, uh, which is controls this part over here. Okay, and you have the dough. It also controls this part here. And you have the filling screw, and the filling screw is this one right here. There's a screw there, and that's what it looks like there. And now that you screw is very unique because as you can see, it's airtight. As soon as the product goes in, it brings it down with pressure and it, it will take uh, your filling uh, nicely down to the filling pump. This is the, the heart of the machine. Uh, it has a filling pump with two uh, star type dials that further helps and pushes the filling through a large pipe and uh, this large pipe that comes with the machine allows it to go through here nicely and come out efficiently and it's ideal for chunks of potatoes for the people that like to do um, bigger chunks of now what's great about this machine here is the full body is full stainless steel. It is CE certified. We can do ESA certification if you'd like. But this machine here also has a very large robust motor and it has a gearbox. A lot of them on the market do not have a gearbox. This one does and this is very important so that it pushes the dough, stiff dough, uh, through the machine. Over here you have a cooling tank, you put uh, water so that it produces refrigerated water to that component over there. It makes your filling and dough travel through the pipe faster and more efficiently. So you want that part there. Uh, it has a max uh, line on the inside and there's just a little uh, tab here that we put. Uh, recommended temperature setting plus three to five and not to make the water frozen because it is that powerful here is the temperature dial and uh, once um, you you want the water refrigerated cool and that travels over the pump into this part at the end of the day if you want to empty out the water what you do is un unattach the couplings here and just hold these two hoses into a bucket of water and you can remove the old water. You don't have to do that daily, but you can do that periodically, maybe every three days. So what's great about this machine? Let's continue here on this side. Over here, you have fans. Uh, when the machine starts, the fans will automatically come on and that is so that it keeps your machine cool. You have there the, um, the other parts of the, the machine. Over here, you can see another motor, okay? And what's great, hey, we will take this machine and we do the electrical here in-house, nicely done by CM Machine Services, okay? That's one part. This machine, as you can see, is very accessible for service. Any maintenance person working on the machine here, any maintenance person working on the machine will uh, love this machine for 
the user-friendly accessibility to parts. Okay, again, we take this and we install uh, components here in-house. This is Delta. This is UL certified components. And we do the rest of uh, the wiring all nicely done. You can see there in the back, all nicely tied in. And there's another motor over there. Okay, full stainless steel body. This plate over here, there's no steel, there's no sheet. This is all full stainless steel, high quality. Okay, so now we're gonna close this up here. And we're gonna close it up again. Here's a great part here for understanding. This type of uh, technology over here will allow the user to put approximately 5 kgs of dough and leave it. You don't have to press it. You don't have to push it. It's because of the screw over here. You'll see some machines that have one screw or two. This one here has one main pusher screw. This uh, other type of screw here will also bring the dough inwards like that. And this one does the a simulation of someone pressing it. The dough will come through here and press it. You can basically put the dough here, walk away from the machine, have your settings all done there, and you can walk away from the machine if you need to. And uh, over here, you have the, the, the lever that will adjust the speed of the uh, flour if you need to put flour. We also have a safety grip. And the safety grid automatically falls because it's not supposed to stay up. There's safety there so that you don't put your fingers in there. Okay, so this is the machine. Great, fantastic machine.